Former Atlanta police officer Garrett Rolfe has turned himself in on 11 charges, including felony murder. An investigation showed he fired the shots that killed Rayshard Brooks in a Wendy's parking lot in southeast Atlanta. Officer Devin Brosnan, who was also involved in that traffic stop, was booked earlier today. At yesterday's press conference, Fulton County District Attorney Paul Howard accused Rolfe of kicking Brooks after shooting him. Rolf's attorney disputes several of the DA's claims, saying Rolf's use of force was justified because Brooks attacked the officers and stole a taser. As for Officer Brosnan, the DA accused him of standing on Brooks's shoulder after he was shot and that two minutes passed before they gave any medical aid. Brosnan's lawyer says he's concerned about those claims, noting Brosnan was injured and had a concussion. When we asked about the DA's claim that Brosnan plans to testify against Rolf in court, the attorney says the officer did not agree to that. And we now know during the traffic stop, a third bullet from Rolf's gun hit a truck that was also in the Wendy's drive through And today we heard from two people who were inside of that truck. They are now witnesses in this case, and they were just visiting from out of town. Michael Perkins and Melvin Evans say they saw Brooks running toward them at one point and heard the taser and gun go off. Perkins says that's when he dug down in the back seat, and they didn't know a bullet actually hit their car until after they left. After their first couple of shots, their first shot, maybe the first shot I took. After that, I didn't see nothing else. I'm hearing screaming in the car from his girl. Then I heard him say, man, they, he dead. Because I guess he seen the body. I didn't see the body. The two men have already given statements to both the GBI and the DA's office.